Hey viewer, welcome to this channel. In this video, we're going to talk about how we can remove a URL permanently from Google. So let's say you have a blog. Uh, let's say you have a blog that you have created and uh, you want to remove you want to remove one of the URL from there because it's not any useful anymore. So how you can do that permanently. So there is a rule that people say that you can go to Google Search Console and you can come here at removals and you can uh, click on new request, put your URL that you want to remove and um, just click here and next and boom, done. No, but it's not like this. Now you can clearly see here block URL from Google Search result from about six months in clear grants so it's gonna vanish for six months only but if you want to remove it forever permanently so you gotta follow some steps that i want to show you right now um first of all let's see you want to remove any url so all you need to do put your site colon and your website name from here and whatever website whatever url is indexed here and you want to remove one of the urls so you can copy that url um, um for example let's see let's see let's see yeah let's see let's see this one okay let's put this copy the url and you can go to your wordpress dashboard and you can download a plugin which is called 301 redirect so you can click on that and you can install it so i have already installed this plugin so what i can do i can go to my plugin section and I can start working from here. So I can see, you can see here is 3-1 redirect. So I will go to manage redirection. And um, the URL that I copied from there, I'll just put that here. This is the old URL that I want to redirect to the old new URL. And here I just want to redirect it to my home page. So let's see. Okay, let's um, click here and put the home page URL and save. So now, Anybody is going to click on this URL is going to be redirected to my URL. For disclaimer, my friend, you cannot remove the URL which is just indexed once. So what you can do, you can redirect it using some plugin. In my case, I've been using this 301 redirection plugin. You can use different, but that's what you can do to remove it permanently. I hope you understood in this video. If you want to understand something else, you can make comment and subscribe to my channel. That's it. Bye-bye. Have a great day.